Ah, what is up, YouTube? It is your boy Speedy Corey Six coming to you with another video. And in today's video, we are going to be doing a POV in my 600 horsepower G37. So let's get right into it, man. I haven't done a video like this in a while, so this should be pretty dope. <laughs> Right, Alright, switching over to the GoPro now. But if you guys are new to the channel, this is my single turbo G37 IPL. We literally just got it dyno this week. Uh, we made 600 horsepower, 602 horsepower, and then 600 torque, which is insane. So on 18 pounds of boost, uh, let me give you guys a little quick little, you know, a little something. Huh? We recently just made a 600 horsepower and 600 torque on the car. Um, I have a built motor um, and it was only on 18 pounds of boost. Not only, that's like medium. But we, my goal is to make 700 horsepower with this car, which I can. My motor is capable up to 800 horsepower, honestly. Uh, I just need more boost. And currently the car is only on wastegate. It's only on a 20 pound spring wastegate, which really peaks at 18 PSI. Um, so all I need to do, I don't have a boost controller right now, but I am going to get a boost controller now um, just so we can bump it up to 25 PSI. Once I bump it up to 25 PSI, we should be able to make 700 horsepower. So for sure, for sure, to be able to make 700 horsepower. So I'm super excited, but right now, 600 horsepower, this legit feels like 700. Like, this is a real 600 horsepower, you know what I'm saying? Like, not no fake stuff or whatever like all oh, the dyno said no this is a real 600 horsepower on a mustang dyno uh, or i'm sorry on a dyno jet dyno so this is real you know and i make 600 torque which is insane so i can't i can't hook for nothing <laughs> so wanted to give you guys a pov driving the car around uh, i haven't done this in a while so let's get right into the video Fifty fam over there. Sub us up. <laughs> Man, it is such a beautiful day today too. But yeah, 600 horsepower, man. My thoughts on it so far, this thing feels so fast. And it's just crazy because we are capable to turn up to 700. So like, that's just ridiculous. So like cars that can just make 700 like right out the gate, like the new M4, the G80. The new G82 M4s, bro, and like the G80 M3s. Literally, all they need is a tuned downpipe G85, they're making 700. Like that is ridiculous. Like. I couldn't imagine what 700 would feel like an all-wheel drive car with X Drive, but uh, but man, this this feels amazing. Like, there's nothing like banging gears and just driving, and just feeling and hearing the turbo, you know, and shifting with the manual transmission. Nothing like it. <laughs> blow your head gasket trust me i've been through two head gaskets already so i know <laughs> Cop 
motorcycle cop, so I just closed my valve. Now my car is quiet. Stock. <laughs> Clean, little, clean G37 right there. All right. But yeah, I hit the valve now. My car is quiet. You can hear the turbo still, but no more exhaust. You cannot hit the exhaust at all. That's why I love my valve. Everyone asks, keeps telling me get a Tomei, get a Tomei. I love how a Tomei sounds. It's just, it's too loud, bro, especially out here. Nah, man. I like having my valve to hit with a button. Completely quiet. Like right now, I'm in Tesla mode. Like you cannot hear my car at all. <laughs> Super quiet. Hopping on the freeway now, so I'll go ahead and open the valve up. Open it up real quick. You know what I'm saying? Just like that. checking my coolant temps because I'm not trying to crack my head gasket again so if you ever see your coolant go over like 207 just chill out like don't do any crazy pulls your car's overheating if it goes to like anywhere between 220 and 230 your car's overheating like it's, it's too hot like it might go back down but you just don't want to risk it for sure don't do any pulls around there but that's why I like to make sure my coolant temps are at 190 through 200 that's good for me Trying to see if we can catch a run right now. I'm driving hella slow. <laughs> see if someone randomly will pop up on me. You never know, man. I see a whole bunch of cars on this freeway all the time. G82 and 4, GTRs, M3s. I've seen everything. <laughs> all right, I haven't seen anyone, so I'm just gonna give you guys a quick pull. 